Um, mm. So um, anyway, Eric came home within a week before, and she, he said this uh, historic. I'm not. I, I'm. I'm I, I want to quit school, and I said why, and he said because I'm losing my life. <laughs> and <laughs> that hit me, <laughs> you know, uh, when you're worried already. And I said, okay, but like what we were going to do? And he said, oh, I Googled it already. I have a plan. Let's go for home education. Mm -hmm. And I was like, what is that? And how is that possible? And actually, <laughs> Ireland is very, very easy. In Ireland, you simply write that letter. But here in Nevada, it's the same. That like you're quitting school, let them know, and goodbye. In Ireland, it's even much more simple. Because the state um, says that every parent has the right to educate their kids in their home and they can't do really nothing, like anything. And then when I ring this office to let them know, I saw that I'm the only one and we were a case 5,500 something. So I was, oh my God, <laughs> there's so many people and it's a, such a small country. <laughs> yeah. It must be. So anyway, that's how it started. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then uh, all my Irish friends came to me, looked deeply into my eye and said, what's wrong with you? I bring you something? <laughs> this is a seven years old child. He cannot take a decision that he quit school. Oh, how, my goodness. how comes that you allow this? And this continued like for next years. And it was like, the school is for free. God sake, just shuffle him here. And, you know, Irish people tell their kids, Okay, bad luck. This is life. You know, put up with it. <laughs> Get used to it. Mm. And I was just, no, I can't do this to my child. I can't watch his struggle that he's not happy because he cannot learn. I cannot send him every day uh, to fight for so with, you know, somebody with no reason to fight because it's no reason. So that's how it started. Wow. Uh, well, <laughs> It, it was nobody who to support me then. So it was like a three, four years when I was waking up in the middle of night, like <gasps> having panic right? attacks. <laughs> Even though Eric showed me after uh, three months when I tried to make, you know, we make it like in the school, we sit down every day, blah, 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 blah. And then uh, we had, you know, family problems. And I always say, everybody, prepare yourself. You know, it will be hard times. Our neighbors were like, what happened to this nice family? Why are they <laughs> shouting? <laughs> and then I just said to Eric, okay, I give up. You will have to find a school. But Eric said, give me a week. And in a week, uh, I will show you how this has to be done. So, well, really? we have nothing to lose now. <laughs> Wait, how old was he when he said that? Seven, seven and a half by then. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah. Very impressive. Go, Eric. And then he showed us, <laughs> like he he worked all week. We didn't even look at him. We, uh, we didn't we even couldn't because he was preparing day and night. And that time and that week he was interested about how the weather is and how a weather report has to be made. So he set up in the living room a whole studio, uh, a TV studio, all the charts made by hand, uh, all the reports, studied the water cycle, and islands weather, a temperature, what everything means. And by Friday evening he presented us of 30 minutes or 40 minutes presentation in which I was sitting there and I said, well, this is like four years of science from school. <laughs> exactly. Did and you record presented. that? Did you record yeah, that? I know. I, you did? No. Oh. Like we didn't even expect it what will happen, you know, with, uh, not because we didn't trust him, but right. it wasn't, uh, it was something like we said, okay, we were uh, already used to Eric that he's telling things and he's able to articulate things and to make a presentation. We never thought about, and 10 years ago, I don't think, we had this Nokia small phones. I don't think they oh, would be yeah, able to that's record. right. That's right. Yeah. Unless so, if you had a camcorder, it was very rare that you would probably get either usable video or video at all. Yeah. 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 But yeah that, that's a good point. But anyway, that, uh, and then we decided, okay, let's continue. And the agreement was that uh, if he sustained this rhythm, uh, then he will have to, you know, he is able, well able. Well, in myself and my, my uh, husband, we already knew that he will be able. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we didn't know that it will make us to move continents and countries, <laughs> but uh, we never get, regret this. And actually our life is like, you know, so full of uh, events because Eric lead us on this way. Wow. Um, wow. I wouldn't say it was all a joy ride. Of course it's not, but uh, already worth it. So the best is just to come. 